Welcome back to Trey and Tonya's Lovology Season 2, Episode 1. I won't even tell you what we're laughing about. Trey um, crazy. Hey, I'm keeping it real with my baby during the commercial breaks. But um, anyway, we're going to go right into our comments. Wow, this one is coming from Brooklyn, New York. Um, it's, it's pretty lengthy. Um, you want me to take this baby or you want to go in? Shoot, go um, in, baby. My Lord. Th this person starts off by saying, I must apologize now because I tend to become long-winded. I have stumbled across your show some time back and have been watching episodes every now and again. I think you guys are great, and I wish you much success in what you're doing with the show. I love it. And then she goes, is this her comment right here? That's the rest of it. Oh, here we go. Then she goes in to say, I never responded. I never respond or make comments on any episodes, but the squirting and peeing episodes hit home for me. I got to tell you all this. <laughs> We're, we're in a new season. Season two. And they still talking about the squirt and the on people. <laughs> That's, we need to write a book about squirting. I'm, I'm for real. All these Our comments. viewers are just like nasty. It, it's, it's crazy. They're some little horny toads. That's all they want to talk about is squirting and peeing yeah, all over yeah, people. Y'all cannot let the squirting go. <laughs> so go ahead and finish, babe. Because okay. we have two more comments on here, I think, about the squirting. I am 34 years old. I'm a 34-year-old femme who has been with my 36-year-old stud for three years come June. And let me tell you, as a femme, when I finally was able to get my stud to let down her guard, she was squirting. I did not know what to think. I immediately asked, I immediately asked her, did she potty as Tanya would have put it when it happened? However, she was shocked herself because it never happened before, before me, she claims. I thought it was cute at first, but the preparation of it now is much. I had to purchase old style cloth hospital chucks that you can wash because it's a lot. As Tonya had asked the question, I had asked it in X, is it train? Is it train? Is it a train thing? thing? Can you control this? Because now you literally soak in the bed. She has tried to control it, but Tonya, to answer your question, it shot me in the eye. The wall. Yes, girl, the wall. LOL. In countless other places. Ooh. We are on our third mattress. Girl, you in Brooklyn. <laughs> they're on their third mattress because of it. But this time, the hospital chucks help. Thank God. Thank, thank goodness. You. Sometimes I do like it. It turns me on. But the prep time for it kills the mood. When I'm into my babe and just want to get my groove on, and we have to stop and go get the chuck. Hello. Sometimes I just want to get it on, but I have to be realistic. Do what a wet bed. Do I want a wet bed and the pricey new mattress? Nope. So I grab a chuck. Sometimes we cannot help ourselves because it gets that good, but then house furniture becomes wet beyond explanation. It doesn't matter how sex is performed between us. She is wetting everything. I remember one time I thought she peed. She said no, but I was like, um, I don't know. Hence mattress number three. I love Dang. my bed. Three mattresses. Those are expensive. That's a lot of piss. I mean, that's a that's lot, a of, lot squirting. of squirting. That's a lot of squirting. Jeez. I love my that's baby. super squirty way. Uh, don't start with I'm those just saying. Sounds. I would, I love my baby. I would not change anything about my stud, even her, her over drenching wetness. <laughs> I didn't think this was something that I would be into, but I feel some time of I see I feel some type of a way when it doesn't happen. Go, Go figure. figure. Wow, Brooklyn, man. <laughs> James, did they say have changed the mattress three times? Three times. The girl squirting. See, what's the what's the hospital chucks? What's all that? What is the hospital chucks? I don't know. What's the hospital chucks? I guess it's something where if you pee in the bed, it don't go through to the mattress. Oh. Man, so you mean to tell me y'all have to invest in hospital chucks, Brooklyn, so your girl don't, she is a big squirter. She's a wet chuck. She's full of liquid. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Brooklyn, I'm sorry. Your stud lover is full, baby. You hear me? If y'all have bought three mattresses, that's a lot of, that's that's a lot lot of, of squirting. That's a lot of squirting. Y'all might be setting the squirting record. Oh, Guinness Book record. For we real? Need to send we need to send that. And how can somebody go through three mattresses? I don't know. You sure she ain't peeing on you? Or did peeing in the damn bed and talking about she's squirting? Did you check the color? You sure she don't have a bladder problem? Ooh. 
Baby, don't start problems with these people. Okay, Brooklyn. She's a We're sorry. You were sorry. Brooklyn, Brooklyn. No, what kill, what's getting me is the three mattresses. That's a lot. But I'm happy I have some kind but of. But I'm happy you. But, but she said she uh, likes it though. She said, and when she when it don't happen, she got kind of get a little upset. Cause she wondering why why she ain't slapping me in the face with, with the, the with the all across the wall and over the head. I mean, I, yeah. Wow. Okay, Brooklyn. Shout out to you and your partner yes. with the squirting. <laughs> Go ahead, girl. Alrighty. Wow. Uh, my next comment. I would like to thank you for that episode because it got us really talk, really talking about it again, and going to, and got into it. Oh, that's her still. Is that? Mm -mm, that's someone else. Okay, I like. I would like to thank you for that episode because it got us to really talk about it again and go into real depth about it. She says she tries to control it, but she but can't sometimes. To her, when she is getting that good, good as Trey put it, it's it's be too it be too damn good. Now who can be mad at that? But she said she knows when she has to go potty and gets her butt up. Mm. Okay. Wow. That was another, I guess it's talking about the squirt. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of hard when you're in the middle and that good, good, you know, and you right here and you go, oh boy, squirt, squirt, get up. You got to just let it out. No, you don't just let it out. I'm, why not, babe? She's talking about if you got to pee. You gotta well, she go already got it under control. She go to the bathroom and she got to pee. Um, That's moving crazy. right along with y'all squirting and pissing so, Um Thank See. you. I love y'all. I watch you all, and then I have my girl watch the show with me. She also likes you all. We we be like, you heard what Trey and Tanya said. <laughs> but for the most part, we agree with a lot of the things you all say. Love you all together. And Tanya, your makeup is the shit. LOL. Excuse my French. Love it. Yeah, no, that is not Thank French. You. That is straight English. Stop blaming on the French. Thank you. I appreciate the compliments. Mm. And Definitely appreciate you guys following us and watching our shows. And you know, it, and we do try to keep it as real as possible. We and, do. and we don't, like we said, coming in. I think from episode one back in December that my baby and I are not professionals. We are not psychologists, yeah. even though we have educations. Um, we we don't specialize in this as a as a background. We can come and sit in our office and we're your shrinks. <laughs> um, so we keep it real as possible, and we talk about stuff that we've dealt with. And some of the questions that come in are things that hit close to home, so we yeah. keep it real. I'm not, I don't, I definitely not gonna sugarcoat anything. She won't. Um, I'm, I'm, I, whatever comes up, come out, and I don't mean to hurt any feelings. Yeah. That's just how I am. That's true. So we definitely appreciate those that do follow us and do, you know, say that we appreciate what Trey and I give you guys back as our opinions, and that's all it is, our opinions, and we do hope that we're helping someone in their relationship when they are going through trying times. You know, there's no hope. We're helping a lot, baby, because I think the followers that we have, we have a mutual respect to agree to disagree on some things. And, you know, like my baby say, we dis we agree, disagree on things. All the time. Just like, you know, you guys will also, you won't always like what we have to say. Yeah. And, but, you know, you send in your questions and we're giving you our opinion based on our experiences. Yeah. So we appreciate love. Uh, the next comment, moving on to the next comment. I told my babe, that I will be sending you guys a response. She said, send an inbox and make sure they don't say your name or mine's as well. LOL, I can understand that. Thanks again and keep the loveology going. Once again, we always keep it anonymous. We don't like to mm -hmm. disclose anyone's um, um, personal, personal name. Personal name names, or, especially if they don't want that. Yes, we don't do that. We definitely respect that. We want to say right now, if you hear some thumping, excuse it. It's our dog, Princess, that will not leave from under the table. Little Chihuahua, she swears she want to be on TV. She's human. But um, right now we're protecting our baby. You know the paparazzi, they get a little yeah, crazy with the kids. Sweat so. Princess. <laughs> we want to keep that private. Um, but um, we're gonna go ahead and move right into our our fifth um, comment for this episode. We have a lot, guys, so please bear with us. It might take another segment. Yeah. All right. Um, hi, you guys. I love the show, but I didn't know about the squirting until about four years ago. I have been with my mate for the last nine years, and this has become a new sensation in our relationship. But I got I got it off the show. Can't really remember her name, but it's the old lady that talks about sex. Must be. So she explained that it's not pee, it's an orgasm, just as Trey said. And it comes when you are really, really into, and the G spot is being hit and rubbed against LOL. It got me, it got me too at first, but now we are loving it. <laughs> Mm. Is it Dr. Ruth? I think so, the old, old lady. lady. <laughs> I used to watch. That lady was smart with her little funny looking self. 
um, going on, we're going to move right through, guys. We're really trying to make these segments short for you guys. Comment number six, I had the opportunity to view your show. I was very impressed, and I found myself watching all the episodes online. You guys make a wonderful couple. I am a stud, and my mate and I have been together for four years, and we are hanging strong. I also, I'm also a pastor um, at a, a welcoming church in Lawrenceville. Your show brings inspiration to many. Keep doing what you are doing. I just wanted to encourage you both to stay strong and keep representing for the LGBT community. Much love. Oh, thank thank you, you so much, Pastor Anonymous. We appreciate that. Um, next one is, I love your presence here and I'll be going back. Like your other fans, to enjoy your loveology from start to continuation. Your love is powerful, fun, and possesses a staying power that will stand and stand the test of time. Thank you for allowing me and the other viewers to take this journey with you. Love you both. Oh, thank you guys. Mm, was, we really, really appreciate these comments. That was the lady bestseller. Those, you know, these are our motivations. We met her. She was at um the retreat. Okay. She oh, was the author. Oh, sure was. Sure she was. was the author Another author that we met. So thank you so much for your support. Yes. Um, moving right along. As far as FB and and on any other okay, site, come from a, another one of our episodes. They responded to a comment. Okay. As far as FB and any other site, download MySpace, Once Upon a Time, LOL, etc. It's not FB. Oh, this is when we were talking about, does FB destroy relationships? Yeah. And this person is responding back. As a comment. Saying that FB itself destroying anything, but it is what you do on those sites that's like saying all clubs destroy relationships. It's what you do, what you do with the people you meet and the conversations you have that messes up relationships. FB can't hook you up with anyone. If you're having a conversation that you shouldn't be having with someone knowing you are in a relationship, the blame is solely on you. So this, this viewer is just saying that they feel that FB cannot mess up a relationship. And I beg to differ still, but we all have our opinions. We agree to disagree on that one. Yeah. Okay, moving on, baby. Go ahead. Uh, there are women. Oh, God, Squirt. you guys. Squirt again. You squirting buttheads. You, there are women. <laughs> There are women that do squirt. However, I have never experienced one that was so much that she peed. I don't think you can control that if that's the way you orgasm. Also, some women are embarrassed that they squirt. I think I would take a break if I got to pee. If I no, I think I would take a break if I got pee in my mouth. L O L. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Well, y'all are crazy with the squirting yeah, they're comments. Crazy. They're real crazy. It's all good though. Oh, that's funny. Let's move on, baby. Um, thank you for your comment. Thank you. Squirt of viewer. It's good to people. It's good. It's good to people with some good common sense. Yeah, they see people wow, what is what Oh, there was missing a word. It's good to see people with good common sense and knowledge. There are so many videos where people give their advice and it makes no sense at all. I agree with what has been said in this video. And it was responding to one of our first episodes. I don't okay. know what segment though. Yeah, we still we appreciate the love that you guys are keep still going looking back. Going, some people that's new is going back to start from video episode yeah. one. Yes. And working their way up. So yes. catch up and we truly encourage you guys to continue to follow us and embrace us as we, you know, embrace each other actually. Okay. And we definitely appreciate it. This one is the last comment. Go ahead, baby. I'm last absolutely comment. a fan. Your realness has encouraged me to embrace my relationship and know that we can have a beautiful, healthy relationship as lesbians. It may sound crazy, but I really needed to see an example of what I knew was able to be between the both of us. Thank you both, and I love you both for your sincere advice. That's sweet. Mm. That was nice. That was nice. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. We appreciate it. Whew, there was a lot of comments. Yeah. We're going to take another quick commercial break. Trey and Tonya, Lavology, Episode 2, Episode 1, Season, season two. 2, Episode right. 1. Yeah, good grape juice, I tell you. Yeah, um, I bet. Thank you. We'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> 